Now, 25% of the Nigerian population are carriers of the mutant gene and the prevalence of sickle cell anemia is about 20 per 1,000 births. And these frightening statistics is according to the World Health Organization, but the sensitization hasn't stopped. TVC News Olawako caught up with a winning warrior who highlights some of these challenges. Bimbo Lawson has been a living warrior for almost four decades. She has lost a sibling to sickle cell. When I was growing up, we were three in number. One is already late, and I still have a, an elder brother that is still living with sickle cell. And the water has been our major means of surviving. The challenges encountered by people living with sickle cell disorder in Nigeria are numerous. But one winning warrior, as they are fondly called, who has decided to lend her voice to the advocacy is Ulua Femi Ajayi. When, when exactly did you start this, this NGO? She has been living with sickle cell disorder for over four decades, but believes more can be done to stop the sickle cycle. Hence, the creation of Gale Sickle Initiative. There was a time, um, there was a time I had surgery and the way I was taken care of, I, I was able to survive that challenge. And so we got to me. One of my fellow winning warriors, my, my people living with sickle cell in Nigeria, those who don't even, have, have, who don't even stand a chance to travel out. What is their lot? Religious and cultural factors as well as stigmatization are seen to have added to the problems. Once your genotype is not compatible with that of your spouse, it is not advisable for you to continue and get married. Because once you get married and you start having kids with sickle cell disorder, will love come in then? Will love cover for, the, for that challenge? So let's get, get our act right and our fact right and know that genotype compatibility is very important. I don't allow the society to get into me, I mean, with their stigmatization anyway. I, um, you need to have, um, uh, uh, to have confidence in yourself, one. You, you don't even look at the society, just focus on, on God and then... Good afternoon. Oluwashi Yajai is a natural caregiver whose twin has been living with sickle cell disorder. As she gives care to her twin, Mrs. Ajayi encountered some challenges. She outlines how winning warriors can be further helped to survive with the disorder. Us, that are caregivers, we are family members most of the time. And it is tasking, especially when you cannot help that person through the pain. You don't know what they are facing. They can only tell you and sometimes they can't talk because the pain is so intense and it's so painful and you look at them and tears well up in your eyes. You can only help them with the drugs. So for us, we, we are hoping that the government would please help the winning warriors by giving them better health care. How can the mortality and morbidity rates be reduced? When children with sickle cell disorder are screened, immediately they are born, yes. Then they have immediate access to good health care facilities. So the, the mortality and the morbidity rate is reduced. The moment you know that this person has sickle cell as a baby, yes, he starts receiving treatment. We don't have to wait till he's one year before uh, we discover that who oh, has got sickle cell. By that time, it might be too late. So I'm imploring the government, please actualize. I know you've started something in the northern part of Nigeria, but please make it go round the whole zone in Nigeria. Okay, very big thank you. The Girl Sickle Initiative is also helping to empower winning warriors for them to be economically reliant. So let all employers come together and do a communicate. What can you do for, for my fellows? What can you do for us? Maybe in every company, let's say there's a company with about 100 members of staff. Maybe in, one of, in, in 100, you, can, you could do two living with sickle cell disorder. So with that, we could have a better life for all. Nigeria is said to have the largest number of people living with sickle cell disorder in the world. 
but with efforts like this in place, the sequel cycle is expected to stop in the shortest time possible. Ola Awakon, TDC News, Lagos.